Okay, now, this is the same one play from the first video. I'm moving on to shaping. Uh, let's see. Shaping, I normally do from the inside out. My first shaping, uh, bits of shaping, is I try to get more of an egg shape. A uh, little more inside pressure than outside pressure. Notice I'm not using hardly, I don't use a lot of water during this process. If my hand starts sticking to the clay, I'll go back in and put a thin, a very thin coating of water on there. I'm not trying to get height at this point in time. I'm just trying to pull it out to the general shape that I want. Since my base is a little bit wide, I can go in and choke that base in. A little bit above there. All the way down to the wheel head. Bring it in, very steady hands. That's kind of the key to that one. Okay. So, back down all the way down to the bottom. A little more inside pressure than outside pressure. And I start switching about here, I start switching from inside pressure to a little more outside pressure to bring it in. Okay, if I want to keep the throwing rings, then, then I'll stop using so much exterior force. Take a rib like this, let the curve of the tool do um, your work for you. Some people start at the top, some people start at the bottom. Uh, it really doesn't matter whichever works the best for you. Notice I'm not shaping massive, I'm not trying to get the shape right away. I'm coaxing it into shape. You can also use, if you would like, the flat edge of a rib. Um, this one I made myself, this rib I made myself, but you can also get one of these. This is a purchased one. And then you can, pushing it against the rib, stretch it out. That little wobble right there it's because my hands are very dry on the inside and it was starting to catch. If that happens, you can run a little water on the inside, a little bit of water on the inside, just as a lubricant. If it starts wobbling like that, Ease off your pressure, remove your hand slowly, and go back in.
Okay, that's a pretty nice little pot right there. Uh, but I want it to be a little more fat. I go in and take care of some of that extra clay down there that I don't, that I'm not using. It also has a tendency to narrow that foot. Okay. So now I can go in. See what happened there is I wasn't paying attention and I slapped it with my finger. So there we go. If you do things gently, you can correct a lot of things that go wrong like that. Um, now I'll go back in, compress that clay a little bit. My shoulder, still a little bit of a knot there. at the angle on that that I want. Notice it's starting to wobble a bit.